name is Herbert Miller, and the uh, first time I saw Father Capon was when I was laying in a ditch, wounded. Well, Herbert Miller was a, a man that was in Father Capon's unit, um, and he and uh, other men were, were trying to escape or trying to make it back to, to safety. This soldier come down through and he stood over, he's going to shoot me had the gun pointed at my head. And he said he just closed his eyes and he said he knew that the next thing that he was going to feel was a bullet going into his head. I looked and this American come across the road. And he said he saw an American soldier pushing this North Korean out of the way. It was Father Capon. He pushed the man aside. Why that soldier never shot him, I'll never know. Army Chaplain Emil Capon will posthumously receive the Medal of Honor for his acts of valor during the Korean War. I think if he were asked whether or not he wanted this award, he would probably say, heck no, that, that he, he didn't deserve the award. He'd be humbled. He'd, he'd, he'd tell you point blank, I don't deserve it. But he, that's the kind of person he was. But the men that were in the prison camp have been working for this Father Capon to receive this award, literally from the time they got out of the prison camp. I wonder why it took so long. The man should have got it right off the bat for the things he did. Chaplain Capon's family will accept his Medal of Honor on April 11th. <laughs>